up everybody I just wanted to make a quick video on a couple points I want to make here and it'll probably only be a couple minutes um, I wanted to talk first about in this point this is from the, again from the Simo Kimo Gurky and Smith versus Tursky and Ferreira um, and I wanted to talk to you about keeping the ball in front of you and taking the proper lines to the ball. So what you're going to see here is you're going to see Tursky serve and he'll hit a hard fifth or third, I'm sorry, he'll hit a hard third. Gurky will return it back to him. There's his hard third. So he's already served. Hard third into, into Gurky and Gurky comes back and then he approaches here with his fifth, with a decent fifth, but because it looks like he he is wanting to poach the middle, he stays middle and Gurky goes down the line on him with a, with a nice shot. And the line that he takes is is not direct to the ball. To see, to see the way he ran forward and then he ran to the side, almost like he was expecting to volley that. And because he takes this improper line to the ball, you always want to try to, to go in a straight line to the ball to where your paddle is still in front of you. So because of the line he took, he sort of ran up to the ball and then, or he ran forward and then he ran sideways to get to the ball. He's hitting the ball uh, pretty much at his feet and, and gets off balance and gets pulled off the court. So that's what you got to remember when you're after you hit your third you you really got to watch your line uh, that you're tracking to to get to your opponent and and the shots that they can make to try to keep your your paddle in front of you try to keep your contact point so that it's in front of you because it'll help you maintain your balance so you'll see here he gets he gets pulled off So he gets pulled off, and then he overcompensates, and he gets pulled back the other way, and they finish. And then I want to show you on this next point, and this is a big, big uh, dilemma in pickleball, which is what do you do with a, a fifth shot low? And so you'll see a decent third here, and she hits a decent third, but then... There's a sort of semi-punish by Smith, and look at her, she's, she's still kind of in no man's land, and one of the hardest things to learn in pickleball is to not try to punish a punish. Uh, that generally does not work. So when somebody's hitting a punishing type shot at you, it's pretty hard to punish it back. You, 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 you're going to be in a defensive mode at that point, and you're generally going to want to just hit it soft or, or loosen your grip to where the ball uh, either just goes over the net or to where you angle it to where it's a it's a difficult shot for your opponent but you're generally not going to be able to speed it up so she tries to go hard back and look what happens just goes out so just remember on that fifth shot uh, if it's hard or if it's somewhat of a punish you're generally not going to be able to punish it back so try to get it soft over and out.